Well, Uganda is a beautiful country and so it deserves to have better leaders. Well, if you have been on social media, you must have seen a viral video of Jeno Mohozi Kainerugaba in Soroti recently reading a speech and struggling to address the people. Hello. Uh, very many people who are against the MK project on social media have used this opportunity to diss him. Well, they are questioning that how can we hand over a country to a person who struggles to read a written speech? A person who cannot even express his views minus reading from the script. How? As in how? <laughs> <laughs> You're serious. This is the man you want to lead Uganda. Ogum sins. Uh. Well, others are saying that Bobby Wine is a person who will address the public for over 30 minutes minus reading from the script and all the time he's speaking facts about Uganda. But President Museveni's son, Jeno Mohozi Kainerugaba, every second, every time, his eyes are on the script. So a big section of Ugandans who are not in support of the MK movement are saying, Neda, Neda, Neda. Uganda will deserve a better president, not the type of Jeno Mohozi Kainerugaba. Not at all. <laughs> Even a handwritten speech, you can't read it, you can't even deliver it. Hey, chocolate, chocolate, you have a mama, tata. I'm such a new subject. Speech, you know, you get it that you can set on the speech, you know, with a mutual. Very vibrant, very accurate. Very smart, very reasoning. <laughs> well, that is according to some people on social media. I don't know what you have to say about this, but uh, this story is trending so big time on different social media platforms and making headlines in uh, Jeno Mohozi Kainerugaba's camp. Well, the comment section is very open for you, just in case you have anything you want to say about this story. Well, away from that, in other news, uh, TikTok and uh, Telegram have been banned in Somalia over indecent content and uh, propaganda. And uh, this was announced by the Minister of Information, Jama Hassan Khalif. Yes, that is uh, the latest update coming from uh, that side. TikTok and uh, Telegram have been banned that side of uh, Somalia. And uh, I think in Kenya, it is the same story, but Parliament is still debating about it. And uh, this was after the Speaker of Parliament received a petition, uh, you know, requesting him to ban the app in the Plus 25 for Kenya. Yeah, so um, I think let's just pray this doesn't happen in Uganda. Uh, we just have to use TikTok appropriately. Otherwise, we are likely to face the same problems. Uh, TikTok lovers, uh, be very careful on what you post on your channels. Well, there you go. That is uh, the latest update I got for you right here on the Buzz UG. Uh, don't forget to follow me on TikTok, Amelads Milo, aka Fuller, and also uh, subscribe in case you haven't, but also tap on the bell for all the notifications. It is a bye for now. Thank you. Audio jungle.